Hello students, welcome back to our new video session. So this video is for class 3, chapter 15, calendar, exercise 61. Question number 1. Fill in the blanks. A. Rajan was born on 25th February 2008. We can also say that Rajan was born on 25th dash 2008. So we, 25th. 2008. We can call it as 25 February 2008 or 25 to 2008. So January, February. Second month is February. We will write February. How old will he be in March 2025? So first of all we will write March 2025 minus 2008 so 2025 minus 2008 we will get 17 so 17 years how old will he be in March 2025 so he will be 17 years old in 2025 how old will he be in March 2051 so March 2051 minus 2008. 2051 minus 2008 we get 43. So on how old will he be on March? How old will he be in March 2051? He will be 43 years old. So we will write 17 years and 43 years. D. On what date will he be 8 years old? So Rajan was born on 25th February 2008. Now on which date will he be 8 years old? So we'll add 8 years. So we get 25 February 2008 plus 8 years is 25th February 2016. So our answer is 25th February 2016. E. How many months old? Rajan was on 25th September 2008. So Rajan was born on 25th February 2008. So we'll count till September 2008. March, April, May, June, July, August, September. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So we'll write 7 months. So February is second month and September is nine month. So September minus February is nine minus two. We get seven. So how many months old Rajan was on 25th September 2008? So Rajan was 7 months old on 25th September 2008. 7 months. So our answer is 7 months old. Question number 2. Study the given calendar for the year 2017 carefully and answer the following questions. A. How many Thursdays are there in August 2017? Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017 and study the month of August. As you can see here there are 5 Thursdays. So total Thursdays are 5. Answer 5 
Thursdays. B. How many months in 2017 have five Sundays? Write their names. Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017 and study the months which are having five Sundays. As we can see, January has five Sundays, April has five Sundays, July has five Sundays, October has five Sundays, and December also has five Sundays. So our answer is January, April, July, October and December. C. Write the date of your birth. So this question is homework for you. You have to do by your own. In this question you have to write your date of birth. D. On which day does your birthday fall in the year 2017? So my birthday is on 5th May. To D. On which day does your birthday fall in the year 2017? My birthday is on 5th May and it falls on Friday according to the calendar of year 2017. So answer is Friday. You check your date of birth according to the 2017 calendar and write the answer accordingly. E. On which day does the year 2017 begin? Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017. As we can see, 1st January 2017 falls on Sunday. So our answer is 1st January is on Sunday. F. Find each of the following dates in the given calendar and state the day on which it falls. 23-1-2017 5-9-2017 and 28-6-2017 Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017. As we can see, 23rd January 2017 falls on Monday. So our answer is Monday. Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017. As we can see, 5th September 2017 falls on Tuesday. So our answer is Tuesday. Let's have a look in the calendar of year 2017. 13-12-2017 means 13 December 2017 falls on Wednesday. So our answer is Wednesday. Again, look in the calendar of 2017. 28 June 2017 falls on Wednesday. So our answer is Wednesday. Question number 3. Fill in the blanks with the correct year. A. In which year 
were you promoted to class 3? So this year you are promoted to class 3? So 2020. Our answer is 2020. B. Which year was it 2 years back? So 2 years back present year is 2020 minus 2. So our answer is 2018. C. Which year will it be after 3 years? So present, present year is 2020 plus after 3 years means plus 3. So our answer is 2023. In which year were you born? This is your homework. E. In which year will you be 10 years old? This is also your homework. You have to do by your own both these questions. F. In which year will you pass out from class 3? So present year is 2020 and next year you will pass out. So 2021. This is our answer. Question number 4. Look at the calendar for the year 2017 and write the day for each of the following dates. A. 26 1 2017 means 26 January 2017. Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017. So as we can see 26 January falls on Thursday. So our answer is Thursday. B. 39, 2017. Again have a look in the calendar of 2017. So 30 September 2017 falls on Saturday. So our answer is Saturday. C. 15 8 2017 15 August 2017 falls on Tuesday. So Tuesday is our answer. D. 2 10 2017 Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017. 2 October 2017 falls on Monday. So our answer is Monday. D. 3 May 2017. Let's have a look in the calendar of 2017. As we can see, 13 March 2017 falls on Monday. So our answer is Monday. Now again F 25-12-2017 Let's have a look in the calendar of year 2017. 25 December 2017 falls on Monday. So our answer is Monday. Thank you and have a nice day.